guys, so I'm running errands right now. I uh, have to go to the grocery store and where else? Oh, I have to go to Marshall's, get another thing for Leslie's teacher because she has another teacher in her class. So I have to get another mug. Um, a book, I have to run up to Indigo after I go to my mom's work. I have to drop a few things off to her. Those suitcases I showed you guys. And then my sister is selling these cute little holiday gift things. Um, but I just picked up, make sure there's no information though mine on here i just picked up this cute jacks it for toby bear we think he's a size large i think this will fit him but yeah he already has a pretty thick coat but i said i was gonna get him this in yesterday's video so i picked that one up and then i got this coupon the promo code is new years from january 4th to the 13th 10 percent off of your next 80 dollars purchase which this is kind of pathetic. That's driving tax, but it's fine. So I picked up this coat for him and um, I'm waiting for a few other things to go on sale first because they have a few other things that still goes on for a few more days. So I'm going to pick it up as I need it, but I'm wearing my Pandora bracelet. I haven't worn this thing in years because it like pulls on my hair. But if you guys look, I have a charm for my Harley Who on here. This one's not like an official Pandora charm, but this one is the cutest one I saw on Amazon. You guys can't even tell. Look how cute. And then I have my birthstone one and then one for Leslie. I did have this bracelet clean soon anyway. But anyways, I'm gonna head to my mom's. I'll do a grocery store, bookstore, pick up a mug from another store for her teacher. I hope I get everything done before I pick Leslie up, which I have like three hours, so I should be okay. Holy shit, you guys. Everyone's COVID crazy in this place. Like, asking all the COVID questions before you leave. I meant before you come in. Sanitization and central. And I can't go into any of these doors. Or out, for that matter. This is insane. I feel like I'm literally parked in a zoo. Okay. Okay, you guys. Oh my gosh. Everyone's COVID crazy. Okay, <laughs> uh, I got two of the same mugs for Leslie's teacher. Then I had to get one different one, but I'm gonna put it in like a cute. I'm gonna put it in a cute gift. That's like a book and everything. So everything should be all matchy matchy. I have four minutes to get to my mom's work. So let's make this shit happen. Um sanitized before I left there and didn't touch the door with my actual skin. So, I am terrific. You're turning. Great. Everyone's turning. Um, so I'm all good. I am never going to a mall again. A store they had asked me questions. It was just a fucking hassle and a half to get through. Most stores were closed. That was awful. I don't recommend. Don't go into a mall. Especially, I haven't been in this mall since I was like little. Or no, actually, since I had returned shoes I bought that they sent me the wrong size, but I returned them anyway. The cashier was super nice. I wish I could like tip everyone that's working during a pandemic right now. Like, I want to like send everyone flowers and all of that stuff, which I'm still trying to find a florist that has a really good price that will deliver to the SPCA for me. I might just make my own bouquet and deliver to them. After I go to mom's work, I have to head up to the bookstore really quick and then I have to go grocery shopping. It's 12 o'clock, people say from school around 2.45. So let's see how much I can get done. It looks like it might rain today too. This is my life. Mom doing it all. Um, this might sound super rude, but Leslie does have a favorite teacher. And this teacher goes above and beyond for Leslie. Like, to an extreme level. Like, they are best friends. Like, Leslie's desk was moved beside this teacher because they have such a great relationship. Leslie eats more when she's with her teacher. This teacher gives her... Like, it's pretty much, like, says all these supportive, amazing, positive words like I do. And goes like just out of her way and that might sound super rude towards the other kids but Leslie 
like they just have a special bond and connection. Like Leslie cried last week and didn't want to go into class. So they called her teacher out and Leslie gave her the biggest hug, almost knocked her teacher over and um, went in with her, went in with that teacher without a problem. So yeah, I might go a little bit above, above and beyond for this one teacher, um, but that's just because they have a special connection and I don't want to take away from the other teachers that also just this, it sounds rude to say but if you have a kid and they have multiple teachers in their class it's like her daycare when she last was in daycare she like had a one favorite teacher and they went out of their way for leslie and made sure that leslie felt super confident and happy um and i want the same for leslie for in all the grades to have that special connection with the teacher i had special connections with my teachers growing up and it made the world of a difference. It actually made me want to go to school. This one teacher, this was back when like Snooki and Wow and Jersey Shore was over. So it was just like Snooki and Wow. We would talk about Jersey Shore and this teacher was amazing. She actually ended up getting pregnant, but she carried out the rest of the school year. She came back um, and we saw her, like her baby, like let us meet her the next year. like. The teacher was amazing. She would help me so much. And it was just like, I remember that connection with that teacher. And I really want Leslie to have that special connection with this teacher. There is hand sanitizer available for your use, and we ask that you please keep two meters at physical distance between yourself and others in the store at all times. Oh my god, that was like an awful experience to a degree because I couldn't find the book I wanted, so I just was like, okay, I'm gonna water around and I'll like go back so that it's like a fresh look, right? So Anyways, that it was just annoying, and then the girl at checkout, because, so, the way it works in my family is, with my sisters anyway, I pay for Disney Plus and Spotify, then my other sister pays for Netflix, my other sister pays for Amazon Prime, and then Indigo Plum Plus, which gets us 10% off, which we actually love, and then we just use the points around the holidays. So I got the book and these mittens for Leslie. Saved seven bucks. Sweet. I got, um, cause Leslie needed thicker mittens for, for her stuff. So I just got her these ones. They're super cute. They're like the ones me and my sisters always wear that we actually get from Indigo. They were originally $12.99. I got them for nine bucks plus 10% off of that and then tax, but got these for her. And then for her teachers, I actually picked up this book. Um, it's super cute and they can just like leave in the classroom. I was gonna buy three, but then I was like, I'm not gonna be absurd because it's like, I love my teacher because like right here. So I'm just gonna say, I love my three teachers and then get her to write in it. Um, I just thought it was cute along with the mugs and I'm gonna get them each a gift card. I was gonna get them candles, but I was like, okay, hey, we're not gonna go crazy. There's no need for it. So, anyways, picked up so much stuff. And by so much, I mean two things. And then I got the other mug. Today has just been a day of me like running around with my head with my chicken. With, like a chicken with his head cut off, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, goodness. Okay, you guys, I'm just driving home from the grocery store. I didn't vlog after Indigo, because I had to quickly go in the grocery store. I had to pick Leslie up in about 25 minutes from school, and I can't let her see that I got groceries because she was sad when I told her this morning I was going to go grocery shopping, because she likes to come with me, but, you know, that includes, like, an extra $20. And I got a few things I shouldn't have got, but they were on sale, so I picked them up anyway, which is fine. Um, it's just crazy. What is on my door? It's just crazy to me that um, it's so expensive 
to have a child in a car like everything's just so expensive and as much as i'm grateful and i budget there's just so like so many expenses that are just like oh my god you know okay i know moms will understand this but we do so fucking much like whenever a man's like a mom's job is the hardest job like we literally do a man's job and working all day because if you're a working mom there you go i mean i'm a stay-at-home work at home mom but i would also just like to say like we do so much like we cook we clean we do laundry we take care of the kid we make sure they have all their meals their lunch is ready we have to we're in charge of their imagination the magic and christmas and everything else and every other holiday we are the budgeting ones we do so fucking much and i know that there's so many men out there that do step up and they do help but it's one of those things where it's like money goes by fast it's physically exhausting and we don't really have time to ourselves like even today i wouldn't say i've had time to myself because the second i got home from dropping myself off at school i was making food for myself i showered and then i was out the door running errands getting shit done today before friday hits and then friday it's like the day goes by and then i have the weekend with leslie so there's just so much and like i, I want a man to truly appreciate it that's why like one day when i have a husband like i can't wait for him to be like you know what babe i'll go put gas in your car tonight so you don't have to go out late at night like i don't need a man i want a man and I realize how helpful they can be and just to have someone there at the end of the day to talk to. Like last night, I was literally sitting up late at night and I was honestly getting sad because I was like, I am alone talking to no one and it's just depressing. And I'm not talking about like calling up a girlfriend being like, hey, how was your day? How was like, I don't know. That's what I'm talking about. Like, just to have, like, an adult male conversation is sometimes all I want. And it's kind of aggravating. Like, I do so much. And it's just not appreciated on the level I want it to be appreciated on. You know? And, like, even Leslie, like, she got out of school yesterday. And she's like, Mommy, I love you. You're the best. And it was just, like, it warms your heart. But, like, you want like to hear that every day not even every day which like once in a while from someone that truly an adult that sees just how much you truly do it's like exhausting honestly okay so um that i think was thursday that yeah it was thursday that you guys just saw like that vlog clip and i realized i sound so bitchy and i'm like sorry about that it was just like you can have, like, I was so grateful, like, and I've been so grateful really focusing on myself, but you can let yourself have moments of weakness and give yourself grace when needed, when you're just feeling really hard on yourself. That's normal. So that's why Dad is ranted, and I think it just shows that, like, mothers can get so frustrated, and we just want to be appreciated at the end of the day. That's kind of the moral story here. And I feel like just doing it as, like, a single parent is always so much harder. Um, anyways, but then we go into Friday. Friday was yesterday, which actually was a really good day. I didn't vlog much, um, which I wish I did because it ended up being a really great day. But Friday, um, I ran. Oh, my God, I'm so tired. I ran some errands in the morning. Um, got gas in my car because it was running on empty. And then I came home. I baked cookies. Um, I had an old friend drop off coffee to me. So I thought that was really sweet because just like dropping off a coffee, just it's like, thank you. I needed that. Um, then my sister came over with Toby Bear. We had our Friday night movie night. I baked cookies during the day. So that was fun. I ordered pizza. Pizza Pizza has like a new creamy like the sauce like creamy garlic but it's like a pizza it was pretty good but it made my stomach really hurt so i'm not gonna order that again um but yeah so that was yesterday it was really great but i vlogged the morning so that's the morning what you guys are gonna see right now i'm actually at leslie's dance class right now i'm just waiting in the car editing work at work mom life um but anyways let's continue into the video hello hello you guys <laughs> She's wearing her new dress. 
and um I have to eat. I'm really hungry. Ooh. But I watched Cat and Athlete Night Live last night. Ooh. Then I jumped on live. You know your home was backwards, right? But any of your what a hook fell off? It's right there. What the heck? Two hooks fell off. Three, two, three? Jesus. I'm gonna buy more today. Because I don't like those ones. I actually have to get like the name brand ones, not just like some knockoff shits. Sometimes I'm not like a name brand person like about anything but there's some things you just have to get name brand because if not they'll break mama i'm only was hang on there with her yes. dress mama? anyway yes you can get a hat when you're going to to candy what you can do this is a hat. pop and set okay take a look Thank you. Okay. Fill up. So, yeah, I don't get crap in it. Perfect. Um, I'm going to bake and self-tan today, I think. Um. I'm really tired. Because I stayed up late last night. Can you? I watched Cat and Nats Late Night Live. And I jumped on Instagram Live. And, yeah. So. Anyways, um, I'm not hungover, but I did drink a little bit last night for the live because it was, it's just, it's fun. It's just like you let loose. Last night's theme was F it. So it was just like, who cares? And it was on Zoom. So I was able to see everyone, which is kind of cool. Um, but Leslie has reindeer day at school. So she's putting reindeer. She's put reindeer ears on all of her friends over there. And her silly elf. I actually hate this picture because I feel like I always look so chubby, but it's fine. Probably because they're with low rise jeans. Put red noses on this picture and a red nose on himself because today's reindeer day at your school, bud. And I put him on. Uh huh. Also, I don't know why this is here. My dad thought it'd be cute, like <coughs> for my sister's house, and now it's my little. Anyone else? Parents like that? They're like, oh, this is cute, and then they just like don't even ask. They just bring something home. Or is it just my dad? Anywho, yesterday was busy like and did a lot of stuff. So, today is going to be a chill day. After I drop Leslie off at school, I have to run to the dollar store. I want to see if they have the dry shampoo that I like, which is Batiste, but I can get Batiste there for like four bucks, or I can go to Walmart and get it for like twelve dollars. So, anywho, and so, um, I gotta do that. And I have to get like another tin because um, I'm gonna drop cookies off to like a family friend.